All right, I'm here with Genoa head coach Bob Bergman. Bob, you had a great tournament today. Uh, state title, 113 and a half points to 80 over St. John. Great job. You had six place winners, all top three. Tell me a little bit about those kids, how you got to this point today, all that you were able to do. Yeah, it's just uh, individual commitment to group effort. I mean, all the kids stepped up, uh, especially in the cancellation matches this morning. We went six for six. Uh, you know, Noah Cook, our heavyweight, uh, stepped up big time. He wasn't even supposed to be at, the, at, at this tournament and uh, taking third was uh, awesome. He avenged two earlier uh, opponents that he lost to um, at, at the state duels in the districts. Nice. So it was really cool. Uh, James Amanji, he sprained his foot this week and he battled through uh, a lot to get here. And then, uh, you know, just each match, we had to tape a new way to figure it out. And he was ice bucket challenging it and everything. So we're glad to see him uh, rebound the way he did. And uh, then uh, Dustin Margillo too, and the Kansi's uh, bounced back. And obviously our finalists, uh, Sanchez boys and Dylan, um, just continue to do what they did and um, cloud a lot of points on the board. Can you talk a little bit about the culture at Genoa that has changed over the, the years? You guys have created a, a culture that seems to have tough-nosed, hard-nosed kids, but yet technically advanced. Where does that come from for you? Well, the kids have a lot of knowledge, a lot of background experiences. Both, all of them are heavy in the offseason doing clubs and, and competitions. Uh, our coaches are phenomenal. I mean, Don Emilio, Dave Waldars, uh, Chris Kevin Damian Emilio, uh, Kevin Contos is a huge addition. Uh, certainly help uh, keep, keep us... Uh, Keep us sharp. Yep, that's excellent. One last question, Coach. You guys were able to bring home the first state title at the state duels. This is now your second state title, not only in program history, but in overall school history. What kind of recognition does do the boys expect when they get back? Do the coaching staff expect when they get back? Any, or is it just go back to work and get busy? Yeah, I mean, certainly going to savor it. It's special. A lot of them have uh, worked their tails off for this. The kids deserve all the credit. I mean, our school and the community rally behind this big time, and uh, it's just, just a special moment in time for us, and we're going to enjoy it. But, yeah, we want to be back here next year, so we're not going to, uh, you know, pat ourselves on the back too much. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, in 364 days, I can't wait to see you. Best of luck to the Genoa team. Thank you. Yep.